Hey my frugal friends, welcome welcome and welcome back to my channel, Frugality is Life. Thank you so much for stopping by. Please make sure that you are subscribed and that you hit that subscribe button. I'm so happy to have you. Let's jump right in. I'm so excited to show you guys that I have my binder here all set up for my house ownership box. And we are going to put a little bit of money into it. Um, when I get paid next, I'm going to switch some things around. So my professional binder that I usually stuff and then when the saving challenges are finished, I transfer them over to my house sinking funds. That professional binder, I will no longer stuff. I will give it a break and I will work on this house ownership box. And then the money from here will go into my house sinking funds. Okay. But I wanted to play this. I could not wait. So let's jump right in. So first and foremost, I want to thank everyone who has jumped on my Etsy shop and purchased this box saving challenge, house ownership box. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I am sincerely grateful. And I have, I bought another one of these acrylic trays because they come in real clutch, guys. Um, so you know i have my birthday box which is this saving challenge here then i have my all-inclusive box that's this one and i have my dice in this section so i figured like i have so many other uh, box saving challenges might as well get another tray and put them the cards in so i have the travel saving challenge uh here the travel box from alicia and i just divided it with these like butterfly I think they stick on the wall i got them from my sister when i was in jamaica i actually brought them home by accident these were hers and they were in a bag that i borrowed from her to take back some stuff and they were in it so i'm putting them to work so i just use a paper clip uh some clips to clip them together and i'm just using it as a divider and i thought it was super cool, cute so because i have so many boxes i am kind of like using them as dividers to separate the cards so this one is for alicia's um travel box and then this one is for um the housewives of budgeting box that i have from um neen budget so that's the cards and then these are from a saving challenge that i was gifted um from um uh, taylor over by budget with taylor absolutely beautiful i don't know if she's debuted it yet so i don't want to go into any details and then these are for another box challenge that i was gifted by um she has got it so i have this one all set up now and i am going to try to factor these in and then i have the very infamous candy box saving challenge here as well that i am going to start um working on and then i have the donut box from brandy jenny so they are part they are separated by these little paper clips and <laughs> and butterfly thingies <laughs> so that has been very useful so i'll put this back there and then i'm gonna Go into the cards that you get now with the house ownership box let's see what you get so when you purchase this box saving challenge you get a bookmark because you guys know how i love my bookmarks and this one says my dream house in this house we will laugh love forgive trust comfort give thanks have fun travel pray and give back i have that right there and then you will get the dashboard which is a modern, super cute house. Like this house would probably be 10 million in Canada. <laughs> and then you get the, like this is the dashboard or table of contents and you get 12 saving challenges. So you get um, the house, the type of house, you get the purchasing, you get purchasing a house. So different things like loan payment, closing costs, etc. You get moving costs, you get home decor, house repairs and maintenance monthly costs like your heating your mortgage etc your annual costs like your home insurance property taxes etc then you have renovations and this is your kitchen reno bathroom reno basement reno backyard oasis and then you have the house for sale and so you have like reason for fees etc 
and then I put another, I printed this multiple times, so I have another bookmark here. And then you have homeowner nightmares. And this is a dashboard that you'll get because there's some cards here. So let's go through, I won't go through the cards, but I'll just tell you what you get. So you get six um, IOUs and they are super cute. IOUs and they all say homeowner at the top because I know we are working with a lot of box saving challenges so we want to be able to differentiate them so you have these and i'm just gonna tuck them right here and tuck the rest right here and then you get 84 cards and 12 of which are these nightmare cards so it's like your garage door is not working and then there are some costs you have like your furnace stop working etc and these I, you can separate these and do them separately as, as your budget allows or you can mix them in and of course I am going to mix them in and as I said there are 84 cards guys so this is it 84 cards and of course they're not cut evenly because yeah your girl has no patience when it comes to the cutting <laughs> but it, do the, it does the job it does the job <laughs> so we are going to play today let me move this box and I am going to use this box, which is my all-inclusive um, cards here. And I'm going to just use a, another butterfly divider thingy. I'm going to just tuck that in there. And I am going to add these to that box. You gotta share, you gotta share. So that's it. So let's put this in here. I'm gonna turn them around and I'm gonna just tuck them in there because I'm gonna just pick from all the cards there. Okay, so let's see how much money we have to play. We've got one, two, three, 30, 40, 50 bucks. And I'm just going to lay it right here because we don't have a lot of space. And so for this one, I recommend pulling the cards and saving because every single icon in here has a card there. My previous saving challenges like the birthday box and the all-inclusive box, I recommended a combination of rolling the dice, like a 12-sided dice, and picking the cards as bonus savings but this time if you want bonus savings I recommend rolling the dice for bonus but picking the cards will allow you to hit up every single icon so let's start by picking one card here and this says home earner find the icon and save the amount so these are literally just search and find cards it will just take you to the icon it won't tell you to double anything you're going to look at the nightmare cards for those so this is the backyard oasis and oh i didn't pick i didn't grab a marker guys so let me grab a marker and what should we use let's use this rose gold or let's, see, let's actually you go with the brown let's go with the brown okay so this is let's see how much this is this little pond here is super cute. And so this is the renovations and the backyard oasis. And this is $5. So I'm going to just circle that five. And for these ones that I've used already, I'm going to tuck them back here for now. And so this is $5. Okay. let's pull another card homeowner and so this says find the icon and save the amount and i know this is gonna be back here so let's see i hope you guys are doing well how are you the kids are back in school how is that going Um, so let's find this. So this is annual cost. So this is a home insurance. And so it's a $25 cost. $25. And if you wanted to play this the low budget way, you could just add the 
two and the five together and save seven dollars okay all right so let's put this in and let's pick another card so this says homeowner nightmare it says your roof needs to be replaced the cost is 15 dollars guys we literally have five dollars left <laughs> so for these cards i will just come to the back where i have the dashboard here and i will just put the 15 dollars in here so there's no tracker or anything for this one we're just stocking the money in here Guys, I really don't want the IOU, but let's go. Let's go for it. <laughs> he says, Windows needs to be replaced. Triple the last card. And what was our last card? What was our last card, guys? <laughs> Thank God it was on the 25. <laughs> it was the 15 was it yes it was a 15 that's 45 dollars are you kidding me so we owe this guys we owe this 40 dollars hmm. yeah yeah the, yeah hmm. i was thinking that the last card was the five dollars but it was not wasn't it the five dollars? I gotta watch this back because I can't believe I got forty dollars. <laughs> I can't believe it, guys. Oh yeah, yeah. Forty dollar IOU. Mm -mm -mm. So we gotta put this here. And if you were playing this the low budget way, all you would do is just save. Like you could just save four dollars. All right. So that IOU is gonna stay there for a while because that's gonna take my whole other budget. I was paying the fifty dollars. So guys, that is the home, home ownership box. And this is on my Etsy shop where you can grab it if you are interested. This is the goal of this saving challenge is to help me increase my down payment that I'm saving for a house. So guys, house prices are ridiculous and the cost is not cheap. So it's a lot of money. So we got to save a lot of money. So that's why these numbers are what they are and on here i tell you that like the minimum you would save is 1105 dollars without the nightmare cards without the nightmare card and without extra savings where you roll the dice you will save 105 1105 1105 by just picking the card and going to the icon 1105 but if you want to save more you can roll the dice and you can like go to different sections and double cross off those icons so guys we ended with a 45 iou i think yeah uh, uh, yeah until next time keep budgeting stay frugal and walk good bye <music>